This is my Tithia story, also known as Memoirs of a Hankler Fisher. I pre-ordered in August, and it's supposed to get here January 10th. Well, that's when it comes out, and I'm not going to get my copy until the 12th or the 13th or something. And so I'm waiting patiently, and I'm looking at all the Hankler Fish pictures on Tumblr and John Green's Facebook, and then all of a sudden it really hits me, like, I really want one. Like, I can't do anything. I can't think about anything that is not a Hankler Fish. I'm so gone. So then it occurs to me, I don't have to sit around waiting for my pre-order. I can get out there and be proactive. I can go Hankler Fishing, just severe, hardcore, so I get ready and I'm running to the car and it's not there. Um, just randomly, my mom had the car that day, which never happens, so I can't go. And then we're really busy that night, so I can't go Hankler Fishing again. And it was supposed to get there that day anyway, and then um, it didn't. But I got Heroes Season 1, and that softened the blow. So I plan on going the next day, except for I have to pick up my sister so I can't go. And also, my pre-order is coming. So I get my pre-order, and it looks like this. Which is nice. I'm not actually sure what color that was. Sometimes it's purple, sometimes it's, I don't know, pinkish. But, you know, it's it's not a hanglerfish. And I really want it. So, I don't actually ever go super hardcore hankler fishing. I've seen videos of people going to, like, 12 stores. And good for you guys. That is perseverance. You deserve that hanglerfish. If you found one, you go. So, I go to any bookstore I can, like, if I'm in the area, and I can be like, Hey, let's go here! So, I, I you know, I make my way to a Target. I make my way to a Barnes & Nobles, but... Days, days pass, and I know it's really too late. It, like, it, I'm not going to get one. I'm not going to find one. And I try to deal with this, but I, I don't want to. So uh, one day, like a week or two after it actually came out, um, I happened to go drop my sister off at ballet and go to Fred Meyer's with my mom. And I just walked by the book section to see if there's anything I want to read. And there's no Fault in Our Stars there. I'm like, okay. But I wasn't looking for it, really. But then we walk past, like, the back of where the books are, and what do I see? Lots of Fault in Our Stars, signed. So my mom and I kind of look at each other and we're like... And mom grabs all of the ones off the shelf and puts them in the cart. We start going through. We open one and it's blue, we open another and it's purple, lots of blues, lots of purples. And then, all of a sudden, mom finds... Hankler fish. Um, there were three of them. So I chose this one. And there was one with kind of like a big jaw, which was cute, but, you know, it was kind of a Goldilocks situation where one was too small and one was too big, although cute. And this one was just right. So, um, I get really excited and I buy this. And then it's mine forever. And then we go to Fred Meyer's the next day. Um... And I leave some Nerdfighter notes, because people are always excited about that. So I thought I'd try it, even though I'm terrible at it. Um, and I find three more Hanklerfish copies um, in a different part of the store. And so this is driving me crazy, because I know so many people, or I've seen so many people who really want a Hanklerfish and couldn't find one. And then there's Hanklerfishes that have just been sitting here for days and nobody's doing anything about it. So I contact all the people I know in Oregon who are... Um, nerd fighters, which is t about two of them. And then I look, I search for Oregon nerd fighters that I don't know, and I find two who I know live kind of close, so I Facebook them like a total creeper and tell them that it's in the area. So then I went back this morning, left some more notes, and originally there were six Hankler fishes. I own one, and now one of them went missing. But I got some footage of the ones that are left. So that is my Hanklerfish destiny, and that's what I wanted to say.